Hello everyone, welcome to Tesla Technologies Private Limited. My name is Ashwin Dutta and today we are going to discuss about industrial sensors. And its order code is 2223 620.3.10F. So in this video we are going to discuss about the working of different industrial sensors. Now this is our industrial sensor kit box. So firstly you need to open it. And this is the main power supply and here you can find all the sensors. So here proximity sensor is there and it is of inductive and capacitive type. Then there are patch codes for the connection and then there are photoelectric sensors. And this is the limit switch and here you can mount the sensors and you can measure the distance at which the sensor detects the metal. So in the power supply, this is the power on off LED indicator, this is the fixed 24 volt DC supply and these are the common ports. Then this is the lamp indication and here we can get the 24 volt common and output ports. So you need to connect the sensors here for detection of metals. Now we will check the sensors one by one. So firstly we will check the inductive proximity sensor. So for that we need to do the connections. So now you need to connect the power supply to the single phase AC supply. So I have connected by using the main spot and then there is a on off switch which is given on the back side of this power supply. So you need to switch on it and here you can see the power LED indicates that we are getting the proper power supply. Now, the first sensor we will check is the inductive. So, we need to connect these three cables. So, the red one is the 24 volt as it is indicated on the power supply also. So, you need to match the colors of the patch cords according to the sockets that are given in the power supply. So here you can see I have connected the red to the 24 volt and the common to the common and we need to connect the output to the output and now here we are having 5 different types of metals so we will use the aluminium you can use brass or steel so I will be using the aluminium one. So here you can see when we will keep this aluminium close to the sensor. So you can see the sensor also indicating the metal. So the sensor is detecting the metal and here on the lamp also you can see the detection. And you can place this sensor on this scale also. So you need to unscrew them a little bit and then you need to hold it. So like this you need to place the sensors and there is also allen key provided. So you can use this allen key to unscrew them and you can place it anywhere on the measuring scale. So this platform is basically used for holding the sensors and you can place the sensors at any of the measurement scale and then you need to detect the metal. So we need to measure where the metal is detected by this sensor. So at which distance it is detecting. So that is how you can connect the different sensors here. So similarly we will check the capacitive sensor. So you need to remove the supply and now we will check this capacitive proximity sensor. So again the same connection will be there. You need to connect the output with the blue, the common with the black and the red with the 24 volt and now again I will be using a metal and then I will keep in touch with this 
sensor. So on the sensor also you can see the metal detection and on the board also you can get the detection. So that is how you can check the photoelectric sensors also. So now we will check the limit switch. So for that again we need to connect the connectors according to the colors. And here you can see this is the limit switch. So as it is moved in the right and left direction you can see the switching at the power on of LED. So that is how this limit switch works and similarly we can check it for photoelectric sensors. So now we will check the photoelectric sensors. So we will connect this red with the 24 volt and common with the black one. So here you can see This is the reflector, so you can reflect it like this. Similarly, there is another photoelectric sensor, so you can check it. You need to connect the 24 volt at the 24 volt port and the black with the black and the blue with the blue. And now when there is an object, it will detect the object. So you can see that that is how this photoelectric sensor works. So that is how you can check all the sensors and you can place them on this platform on the measuring scale and then you can check the distance at which distance the sensors are detecting the metals. So that's all the demonstration from my side. If you have any query regarding this industrial sensor kit, you can contact at Tesla Global website. For more information, you can go through the manual and you can find the similar product links in the description. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, like, share and subscribe to our channel.